need it outside. I'm not at my electronics bench. I'm uh, out in this park and I'm testing out some solar panels, which you can't do inside. And um, I'm experimenting with solar charging of lithium polymer batteries. And solar panels are really interesting because they're not uh, really good power supplies. They fluctuate a lot and the, you know, it depends on how much sunlight. So um, to help me test exactly what's going on, instead of getting out a bunch of multimeters as I've done before, I actually built a portable uh, data analysis and logging system. It's an Arduino in our new enclosure with an LCD. And then I can plug in, as you can see, the battery, the charger, and the cell. And um, the Arduino actually does all the um, analog digital conversion and some analog stuff to tell me you know, how much power am I getting out of the cell and how much power is going to the battery. And so I can compare different cells and uh, different chargers to see how effective they are with solar panels. Okay, so here's the solar panel. Uh, this is the 2 watt voltaic panel. We had some really nice panel. This is the lithium polymer battery and this is the charger that I'm actually uh, modifying. Here's a bunch of analog circuitry I'm using. Uh, what I'm trying to do is get to this sort of maximum power that I can get out of the solar panel and I'm doing that with the addition of some analog electronics. Um, so you can see on the charger, for example, um, let's put this panel in the sun. Um, right now I'm drawing about 280 milliamps and if I disconnect it, I'm only getting 140. Half as much power or half as much current out of the panel. So um, by adding this electronics, I'm getting double um, speed, faster charging, more efficient charging, using the panel uh, as best as possible.